Welcome guys to leg number 48 of the rural world. It's only three more legs and then it's over all over. So how did leg 47 go? Mm, Ustage behind me. Oh, okay. Another five points. So I guess now it's good enough to know that I will be sixth because he has to catch up quite a few points. What did he guess? He guessed Bulgaria on this one. Switzerland. Oh, he was pretty good here. What was that again? What? I almost, I already forgot what this was. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, the dry Russia. <laughs> and he got New Zealand as well. Um. Yeah, not much worse than I am, but there's luckily a few people that squeezed in between us, so that's great. Um, yeah, I looked it pretty well, but he didn't play the whole tournament, right? Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Yeah, he didn't, otherwise he would be better. Also Bulgaria. Switzerland. Wait. No, that's Ustach. Oh, he did well on this one. Wait. Yeah, he did well on all of them, actually. <laughs> New Zealand was the worst for him. That's crazy. Okay. Topotic. Went with Spain. Here. Huh, to Spain? I think I was also considering Spain, but doesn't it look a little bit cool for that? Well, yeah, no, actually, yeah. Spain is not impossible, but I would have rather chosen Italy than Spain. But all right, that's enough for that. And uh, yeah, I'm now in sixth place with 666 points. You know what that means. So that's 29 points ahead of Ustach now. And I now also know why he didn't play um, leg 46 it was. Apparently he got spoiled by someone streaming the challenge. So that's very unfortunate. Um, I'm not sure if he saw all the rounds or just one because if he just saw one then he might have just put it in like zero points and played the rest so he still gets some points but I don't know maybe if see, maybe he's seen it all so Topotic is still far in the lead and Knight is in second so I guess the top three are already set in stone but whoa it's gonna be interesting between mapper and geography challenges i think geography challenges improved over over the curse of the legs i think he yeah i think at first i was before him at it, the early stages and now i'm 40 points back oh now ustach can fight Wemund for seventh place Actually, Lila could also get 7th place still, considering how well he does. But after that, it's quite a gap. Man, how can there be a gap of 125 points? And then there's another huge gap. Huh. But I guess from from here on, here on, there's a lot of people who didn't play all the rounds. So yeah, let's get ahead. Enough talking. Oh boy, I'm scared already. Ooh, with 60. Sun? Uh oh. Oh no. Is this... Is it possible that this is Brazil? This doesn't seem like Brazil. Brazil. 
I just think that's the sign with the big cars on it. And that is usually in Brazil. And I'm not sure... Uh, this sign looks rather unfamiliar to me. And, but if the sun is correct, I mean... Oh, it could also be Argentina. I'm gonna go with Southern Brazil. And hope it's not again like South Africa or something like that. Uh, no, the road lines say probably not. I'm gonna put it somewhere down here. Oh, Uruguay is also possible. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. So they also use that big car. Do not overtake sign, okay. I didn't know that. Yeah, something just seemed off for Brazil. Even though, I mean, Southern Brazil does look kind of similar. Well, that's wrong. I don't need to track it like this. So. Let's check for repeats. Oh, fuck. Uh, that was it, right? That's not a repeat. Okay, so far so good, I guess. What is this? Oh, whoa! One yellow line that is, uh, whew, what country is that? <laughs> oh, 097. Hmm, feels kind of like South America, but, um, I actually do not know. The sun seems to be in the north, so southern hemisphere probably. Is it possible that this is New Zealand? No, it's right hand traffic. So it's most likely South America, so we're gonna go with not on Ecuador, because it could be Colombia. Probably Colombia or Ecuador. Or. No, if it's on hemisphere, it's not Mexico. What is this car here? But I know, don't know cars very well. Oh, Guatemala! But that's not southern hemisphere. Damn you, son. Damn you, son. So they have this one yellow line. I need to remember this. This is quite specific, like one yellow line and two white lines on the side. Not sure if many countries use that. Uh, I guess not a repeat. Mm, very unlikely. We didn't have a lot of Guatemala, especially not in the mountains. We had this one, I think. But none others, it seems. So they are, that's a little bit of harsh punishment in my opinion. Uh, but yeah, all right. Ooh, interesting. Interesting one. After seeing someone stream uh, a volcanic world a lot, this makes me instantly think it's Chile because there's so much Chile looking like that. And the sun is north again. Is this a southern hemisphere challenge? Well, at least the sun is always south. Not, not like in round two. So I don't know any better than that. So we're gonna go somewhat close to the to the border, because in case it's Argentina, can it be any other country in the southern hemisphere? It's very, very unlikely, I think. Like, it could be Peru. I'm gonna go a little bit more north. Because uh, it could be Peru. Ah, oh, man. Come on. Hmm. Freaking Peru. Sometimes it's dry like crazy and then it's green again. Just this country doesn't cannot decide on its landscape. <laughs> Cuz we have dry in the south, green in the north. But this country is just in between and it has everything. And it's huge as well. That's also a problem. <laughs> 
Hmm. Okay. Quite close to Ayacucho. Well, another quite harsh punishment. <laughs> uh, ooh, red soil. That's interesting. Oh, that's Chile sign. That's Chile, and that makes sense with the trees. I didn't know the soil looks like that in Chile, or it can look like that, but I guess... We're gonna stay somewhat close to Santiago here. I'm gonna go with this corridor, like Chilan, Los Angeles. Maybe, yeah, I'm, I think it's not Santiago because it's green, but then again, I could be wrong. Yeah, maybe it's close to Concepcion. Yeah, nice, that's good. That's all, it's pretty good. Uh, did I track the Peru one? Yeah, that's this one, right? That wasn't the repeat. So, again, Southern Hemisphere. We have four times we got uh, Northern Sun. This is also not a repeat. And I've actually never been here in this area. It's actually so close to the coast. Wow. It's crazy. Like, the coast is just on the other side here. Like, oh, we can actually see it. Because that's not normal light. That's reflection from the water, right? Mm, can we see it somewhere? Mm -mm. Is the coast kind of blocked? Here we can see it. All right, last round. Happy about this one, very happy actually. Oh boy, what is this? A weird truck, 450. I never seen a sign like this saying, is this the height of the vehicle that's allowed? So I think it's Asia, right? So now, Mm. Wow, that looks amazing. Look at the triangle shape. Philippines or Indonesia, maybe. Probably one of those. I mean, I got nothing to lose, so I'm gonna go with Philippines here. Somehow, I don't know, this does not this feels different than Indonesia what oh no <laughs> no points <laughs> freaking Colombia again it's always Colombia when you don't think about it when you think about Colombia it's never Colombia how is that possible this country is just I don't know, how can this be Colombia? I thought they are Asian, but uh, I don't know. Maybe I was not thinking well. Especially this guy looks very like... How do you say? Hmm. Like... How do you say that? Um, he seems to be from a country that is more mm, developed. I don't know. Yeah, let's leave it at that. I don't know how to describe what I mean. Um, this a repeat? I doubt because this looked <laughs> this mountain. Holy shit. Is that a volcano? I can check that. So where is it? It's it's northwest of Medellin. It would probably be uh, 
in my volcanic world map if this is a volcano or just a volcanic area even uh, no there's no volcanoes north of Medellin That's crazy. So crazy that there's such a gap here. <clears throat> All right. That was a fool. So I only got half the points that the leader got, which was 90. So. Simi also did well. Holy shit. Whoa, this was like... This was only Spanish-speaking countries. That's crazy. What a crazy seed. Whoa, he got so close. Holy shit. Getting close in Peru, I have no idea how that works. I can understand it in Colombia if you know, at least Colombia has some kind of certain areas, but I have no idea about Peru because it just depends so much how far you are away from the coast. So Lila also did well, except here a little bit. I look. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I was also considering Thailand for a brief moment, but then it was a little bit too mountainous for Thailand. Even the mountainous parts of Thailand are not this mountainous, or at least I've never seen it. Wait, how do people get so close here? They just get close to Guatemala City or what? I don't know this guy. Uh, oh, forgot to guess, Yonika. Would have been a decent score otherwise. Yeah, he got everything pretty good. Geography man. So Mapper did not play already? No, he didn't. Ooh, what happened here? He guessed, what is that, Mauritius? What is this? No, Mauritius is this. That's, um. Uh, fuck, I always forget the name. Man. How is that possible? It's that French island, Réunion. La Réunion. Réunion. He gets Chile there. Okay. Oh, he guessed Guatemala twice. So he thought, oh, another Guatemala. <laughs> Which actually brought him at least one and a half K points. Ooh, Peru. Wait, how? Ooh, okay. I didn't consider that. But I think I usually can tell mm, those desert areas whether they are in South America or not. I, it's just from experience, something, how the roads are made, or I don't know. I, I just see it. I didn't even consider Kyrgyzstan, even though it can be quite dry. Chile, he went with Spain. Okay, yeah, Chile can mimic Southern European Mediterranean, Mediterranean um, landscapes sometimes. But the soil color, I'm not sure, does Spain have that kind of soil color? That seemed very not European, like so much red in the soil. Even though, yeah, so some areas have it as well, but I thought it's more orange, but here it was like extremely red, like almost like Australia. So who else? What went wrong here? Oh, New Zealand and Chile. Argentina for Peru. That's a that's a very interesting Argentina, I guess.
even though of course it can be but why wouldn't you guess Chile because it's much more likely that a landscape like this is um, there but I don't know uh, Ecuador yeah same thought I guess that was where I went wrong Ooh, Taiwan for Colombia man Colombia is such a bitch Yeah, this looks like it can be so many countries. Yeah, Taiwan as well. Taiwan has high mountains. And this tiling looks like it could be Asian, yeah, as well. So, and people, it's hard to see. I mean, they they're quite brown, but also not extremely. So, ah, uh, Colombia, this country is just insane. I gotta visit that. I gotta make a three-month holiday in Colombia. So I never get fooled again. I gotta visit all the areas that have street view. So I get a feeling, so I get an instant feeling when it is Colombia and when it's not. <laughs> all right, I'm ninth for now. Probably gonna fall a little bit. And Ustach didn't play just yet, but yeah, doesn't matter anyway anymore. Um. Well, even though mm, we could go back on the leg that he didn't play and see how many points he lost, we can do that. So that we can say that if he performed the same as I had on this leg, who would have won? Yeah, that's kind of interesting, right? That's kind of a fair way to... Was it this one that he didn't play? Yeah, that's his 46. So I got 19 points. So we add 19 points to his score. That makes it 56. So I have 10 points more at the moment, we could say, fairly speaking. 10 points in three rounds. Yeah, that's still losable. So yeah, let's try to keep the sixth place um, on a fair note. And uh, that's it for the for today. I hope to see you guys on leg 49. Second last leg. Can we reach 700 points? Probably. But all right. See you then. Have fun. Bye bye.